Hello everyone and welcome back to a bit of a different kind of video. So today I'm going to be doing the top 5 things I love about FIFA 17. Now, you might not agree with some of the things I talk about in the video because it is obviously my own opinion. But however, if you want to see more videos like this, please make sure to hit the like button. Also, please click subscribe if you enjoy my videos at the minute. And let's jump straight in. So number one guys is actually the soundtracks on FIFA 17. Now I did say this about FIFA 16 as well, but I just love the fact that FIFA use songs which aren't that popular, but they're still like, you know, groovy, like people enjoy them. Uh, there's a good few like Bastille songs and also Kaigo as well. And uh, I do like them artists. And I just think it's cool how they use uh, songs that people can enjoy, but they're not that popular. But yeah, let's jump in to number two. So number two guys is actually the new f uh, one of the new features on Ultimate Team, which is squad building challenges. Now, finally, as you don't know what this is, you basically submit like a squad of players and you earn like rewards such as packs, uh, coins, and also there's some like special players. I'm actually doing this Jonas one right now. It's took me since the start of FIFA. I've wasted far too much money on it, but uh, I have only got two squads left uh, at the minute. So hopefully, I can finish that and make a video about Jonas which would be kind of interesting to see how he is and if he's actually worth it or not but anyways that is my number two pick and let's jump on to number three so guys number three is actually a bit of a weird one you might not agree with this one but I really and uh, think it's cool how they add so many different and new cards to the game this year especially the card designs look absolutely amazing you can see there we've got informs we've got hero cards i think the inform cards just look cool in general obviously there's the hero card there and we've got scream cards wants to watches movember cards many different cards there and I, I don't know i just think they look cool there team of the group stage that's probably one of my favorite ones this year and silver inform even looks cool and man of the match as well and team of the year there as well and that's pretty much it so let's move on to number four so my number four pick in this video is actually another new game mode on FIFA uh, called Foot Champions. Now if you don't know what this is, you basically play a tournament and then qualify for a weekend league and then however many wins you do uh, determines the good rewards you get. Now basically you are getting rewards for free if you, if you uh, do qualify. I find it very hard to qualify but you can see there you get lots of rewards and stuff. And it's just a really cool thing by you, you know, something that's actually doing right. The, you can earn stuff without actually wasting all your money. But uh, me, I don't tend to qualify for champions, so I've still got to waste money. But still, this is a really cool feature. And I hope to see more things added in uh, FIFA 18, which is as good as this. And this just set a good standard. So yeah, let's jump on to the final thing I love about FIFA. So finally, guys, for number five, it is actually the new feature, which is in career mode which is actually like manager tasks so basically it adds a bit more uh, interest and things to career mode it brings a lot more so you see you've got youth development there uh, you've got brand exposure things like that now not all of it you do get to manage yourself but it's cool how it makes it more realistic and it helps you see what clubs and managers actually go through so that is my final feature so i hope you did enjoy please leave a like and i'll see you guys next time goodbye